<laughs> yo, 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 people, what is going on? That's like a sparkle alert. Welcome back to the episode of GTA 5 Online. Look, I made my little, my little crazy ninja car. This car is fun, not gonna lie. The other night, I was hiding in bushes, and some guy in a plane, or a helicopter kept trying to kill me. Didn't work out so hot for him, because he couldn't find me to lock on. It was amazing. Okay, so, I took you guys' advice. Um, nobody said it in the last video. Also, I don't know how much money I spent last video, but right now I'm sitting on 2.6 million. Why? Because I did my inventory... And I did um, accessories, and then I bought uh, pretty much every single mask you could ever possibly want. I bought all of them. Why? I don't know. I just felt I had the need to to just buy all of them. So I have every single mask. Oh, dude, that one looks sick. Oh, that looks like I'm missing two front teeth. Fail. Total fail. Dude, I like that one. Any of these look freaking amazing. Oh, dude, I need to make a car. Dude, you know what I'm going to do? I think what I'm going to do today is I'm going to make a car that looks exactly like that. Pro tip, I think that's what I'm going to do. I think that'll be on my mask. I'll have a car for every mask. Just kidding. I want this one. Blah, 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 blah. That'll be the ninja car. <laughs> so I have every single mask. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, so um, basically, I listen to you guys. Oh my god, I do not want this mask on. Oh, gross. Accessories. Uh, masks, plays. Uh, th none. Thank you. Um, okay, so... I listen to you guys, and I got the Ding Adjuster. Now you guys may be thinking, Zach, oh my god, that's amazing. And I made it my Iron Man car. Yeah, I know, it is. Pretty freaking rad, isn't it? So I don't know what's so special about this car. I don't know why you guys said, hey, Zach, you should get this. But I had, like, the rear diffuser. I added the front diffuser. I made it with the roll cage. Like, I did a lot of stuff to this. I don't know if this is the car that I want. But I made it look like it's Iron Man, so I'm kind of I'm kind of digging it. Just on the fact that I had the, uh, the paint scheme on it alone. So, I don't, I don't know what's so special about this car. Is it supposed to be really fast? Is it supposed to handle really good? Is it supposed to be, like, the best overall car? I don't know. I have no idea. Hey, look, there's my salt and buy salt. And oh, my God. Okay, we're good. So, it looks like Iron Man. This is my Iron Man car. Also, I, I'm going to ruin this for you guys. It's kind of, it's kind of depressing. Iron Man's colors are the same as the San Francisco 49ers, which is red and gold. And that irritated me. Oh, dude, is that the Scheisser Fuselade? I was actually going to steal one of those. But I don't think I have room in any of my garages for it. Dude, I, it is. Oh, dude, really? Well, let me just park right in front of you. So I think that what I'm going to do is I'm... Okay, so here's, 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 here's my thought process. Are you guys ready? I can either show you guys how to get um, superhero slash themed paint jobs. Okay, to make it look good. Or, I can give you guys theme paint jobs based on masks, based on whatever. Let me see what's in there. If you continue, don't. If you continue into your garage and don't replace a vehicle, you will lose your current vehicle. Well, that's okay, because I never had it in the first place. So, let's see if I can replace anything. I don't think I can. I think everything is a high end. Isn't it? I think so, because I sold that baller and I got the jester. I think every single vehicle is one that... I need, but I have 20 cars. I have 20 vehicles. Oh, a bounty of $1,000 has been sent to me. Well, isn't that freaking fantastic? Let's see. So I have the Sand King, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. That one. If anything, I'd sell the Infernus. Uh, but I don't want to sell the Infernus. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay, I'm good. Uh, are you okay, are you sure you want to continue? Yes. Replace my adder with it. God, that would be depressing, wouldn't it? <laughs> That's kind of what I did with the dead diamond. I replaced it with an LG, and I was like, I'll make this money back. No, you won't, loser. We're going to hot fix it. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, so um, that happened in my life. So you know what I think I'm going to do? I think I'm going to um, I think I'm gonna take a car, and I'm going to make it to where I do that. Let's see. What's a good car that has a lot of lines, a lot of accents? You know what? I think the Zentorno is actually the one because it has those lines on it and those are the lines that you can make lime green. I think that that's what the deal is. So, oh man, I was gonna take that into the paint job place to show you how to do the Iron Man color. So the red is actually really tricky to get. Oh my God, for some reason this like hangs up on that. Yeah, it's no, cool. I just like enjoy staring at my garage door. That's great, thank you. Thank you for doing that. Thank you very much. Come on, go. There we go. Thank you. I don't know why it hangs like that. I don't know. That's weird. But, um, you know, I'll show you guys the thing. Because I don't even have this in Torno here. Let's see. Any of these cars in here would look good with the... 
No, I don't think so. Because those are all like, yo, single colors. I think actually the Zentorno is like the only one that can have it. And the Zentorno is going to look legit in it because it has those like rear vents and it has the uh, the circles in the back. That'll give it like the highlight and it'll make it look popping. But I think it's just black and green, isn't it? Is that all that thing? Is? Oh. Uh-oh. Gingerbread cars. Don't. No. No. Yeah, that's right. Loser. Oh, God. He's going to get up and kill me. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's going to happen, son. Oh, no. He's going to kill me. No. No. Really? Dude, come on. Get a better connection. Boo. Boo. I And you totally ruined my car. You freaking numbskull. Oh, it's because I had a bounty on me. I'll allow it. Freaking idiot. Except he's like right up here. I'm going to freaking murder him. Come here, stupid head. Is he putting that money in his account right now? He probably is. Oh, it's a $5,000 bounty. I hope you enjoy your $1,000, you freaking scrub sauce. <laughs> and you ruined my freaking car, you stupid idiot. Um, there's a car right there. That's a problem. It's a bullet. <laughs> Just hanging out. I'm okay with that. Rocked. Don't freaking just kill somebody. Loser. Well, now that I have shotgun shells all up in my business, that's a problem. Let's redo this. Let's stare at the garage. Oh, wow. They were in a one-on-one -on -one death match? Dude, I didn't know that you could kill somebody in a one-on-one -on -one death match. How did that make you feel? Like, let's be real. Gingerbread cars left. Good! Freaking leave! Took it, he took the money and ran. What a loser. Oh my god, really? Jump straight out into a freaking bread truck. I hate my life. I hate my life. I hate my life right now. Oh my god, I hit that one too. I don't freaking care anymore, dude. I honestly don't. Oh my god, please don't follow me. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Dude, there's like so many shyster fuselage here right now. Um, okay, so today's lesson is going to be how to make an Iron Man car because Iron Man is pretty freaking amazing. So we're going to go over here. We're going to repay to have our car repaired because I freaking can't drive for some unknown reason. Let's go ahead. We're going to do it on the Jester because the Jester is the one that I had. So I was like, hmm, okay. So here we go. Let's repair this car. And I'm going to show you guys exactly the paint scheme and exactly what I did to it. Repair vehicle. Oh, $356. Nice. Thank you very much. Okay. So I, uh, I think I did. Oh, I didn't do any of the armor on this one. Huh. That's weird. Okay. So I put the bumper... I put the splitter on here with canards, and then I did the uh, the rear fuser, uh, fuser, diffuser, but I made it to where it can actually be painted. That way, the carbon will not throw off the color of the car. Um, and then with the lights, yada, 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 I did the, uh, anything that you have to do for a paint scheme, like for the spoiler, you're not going to want anything that's carbon fiber because it's going to throw off the whole look. Like, that'll look, that'll look just dumb when you're driving down the road. That will also look dumb, although color-coded will make it look nice. You want anything that's going to be color-coded, and, and along the same lines as with the skirts. Like, I could use the carbon skirts, but that'll look dumb, so I tried to make it red. Um, and then for the wheels, uh, you need to make your primary color the same color as the... Or basically, you need to make your tire smoke the same color as your primary color. Um, and then you need to make your wheels the same color as your secondary color. So, unless you're going for, like, even though there was more red, like, Iron Man's pretty well balanced about having red and gold, because his main, uh, armor is red, but the, uh, like, skeletal structure underneath is gold. So, all I did was I did respray, I did primary, so he's mostly red, so I did garnet red on it. Nice, right? So, you could do some of these other ones, but I, I felt like he had, like, a, a darker kind of red to him. I guess maybe this one wouldn't be that bad, a sunset red. Maybe the sunset red would be... I think sunset red. Yeah, let's let's change it to sunset red because this garnet red is kind of more like a strawberry-ish. And it's reminding me of San Francisco 49ers. So why don't we go down to the darker red? I think this one would actually look better. I don't have a reference photo. 
but I think based on uh, my memory, I'm going to go with that. I'm going to go with the, the, so we go with Sunset Red. And then for the secondary color, we go to um, Metals, and they actually make one. It's a pure gold. You can have brushed gold if you want to give it like the matte look, but I didn't like the way that would look if the sun hits it. Like, I mean, you can see right there that light reflects, and then it doesn't. It reflects, and then it's nasty looking. So I just did pure gold. And the thing with uh, doing gold and stuff like that, they don't have that for the wheels. So for the wheels, uh, you have to do the wheel color. You have to do it straw brown. Like they have a couple different ones, but they're they're either too uh, bright or they're too like orange. Like they're either too high or too dark. I mean, this bronze one might not be that bad. I think I'm gonna go with bronze now that I can see it better. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with bronze. So go with bronze for the. Uh, Go with bronze for the color. I mean, there is no other, like, dark color. I mean, you could go, in theory, you could make it red if you wanted to. But I like the fact where it looks like the joints. I mean, the red would actually go a lot better. What do we have, the sunset red? I mean, you could do that if you wanted to. If you don't like the way the brown looks, you can go with the sunset red. But I like the way the brown looks. I should just go neon green. How do you like me now? Um, it, we could make it, um, like orange. Is there an orange? And you can make it be like the thrusters of when he's going, but that'd be, you'd be way too far. Or, you know what, you can make it the, uh, the blue to make it look like his, uh, his chest piece. Like that. Like it's glowing. His is kind of like a dark blue. Kind of like that, I guess, is what his chest piece looks like. So, um, so there you have it, the Iron Man car. You can do whatever you want with it, yada, yada, yada. So now what we're going to do is we are going to make the Zentorno. We're going to drive down to the Zentorno. Yeah, I think that, that bronze looks a whole lot better for this car in general. As opposed to that straw brown. The straw brown was like a, a tan type thing. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a little drive see over here to our other house because we're so incredibly rich and incredibly wealthy. And we're going to make sure that guy doesn't turn. Thank you for stopping, sir. We're going to hit this corner nice and easy. Oh, I just hit that guy nice and easy. How did I get a dent on the top of my car? That's depressing. That's okay. doesn't matter. Like, I don't know what the deal is with this jester. I don't know why everybody wanted me to get the jester. Are you guys saying that it looks good? Is that what your, is that what your whole deal was? Was that it looked really good? Oh, let's not park on the side where I'm going to come out at, shall we? So, um, yeah, so you can see right here the, uh, oh my god, why did I not break? Break, stupid. So you can see the red smoke. I mean, I don't even think they make brown smoke, so you can't really do it like that. So, it, it's a nice thing. I mean, you don't need to have it, but it'd be nice to have it if you kind of want the continuity to, uh, to collaborate together. So I think I'm going to replace. Let's see, I need, hush, Sam. Um, let's see, we're going to do inventory, we're going to do accessories, we're going to do masks, and we are going to put on our, this one, this one. Yeah, all it is is black and orange. So what we're going to do is we are actually going to go into here, and we are going to do a black and orange, I wonder if we could do like a black and orange motif. So that way, if you guys actually want to walk around, maybe I'll, this will be looking really awesome, and it'll be like my actual crew. Look, if you want to be in the crew, you have to wear this. We can have a whole bunch of people driving around in Zentornos that are the same color. They get out, they're wearing the same clothes with the same mask. That would look sick. Um, let me see. Where's my bedroom? Oh, downstairs. This old house, I haven't been in it in a while. So we're going to go all the way down here, and we're going to see if we can change our clothes. So we're going to do, like, a whole theme. Let's see. So we're probably going to want um, a t-shirt. Is there a orange and or a... I know there's a black one. If there's one of these orange ones, we might not even need to have a t-shirt. I mean, we could do this, but I kind of want it to be, let's see, shirt? How about these? Oh, God. Oh, well, there we go. That kind of matches, doesn't it? Mustard? Oh, gross. Oh, that one actually, oh, man, if that was a little bit darker, if that was a little bit darker for the orange, so that mustard one actually doesn't look that bad. So here's the deal. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to go t-shirts. No, wait, we're going to go to shirts. We're going to find the mustard untucked. This one, we're going to put this one on. 
And then what we're going to do is we are going to... Man, I wish that you could have gloves. That would be nice. Um, and then our pants. Let's see. And then we're going to give a hoodie. And then if we can give like a black hoodie, that would look nice because that'll give it that whole black and whatever jazz. Let's see. Oh, I have new baseball tees. Oh, look, a red accent one. That's nice. Oh, wait a second. No, that one doesn't go. Uh, no. Polo shirts. Anything go red. No, it's that white that's throwing it off. Oh, man, that's depressing. Uh, sports tops. No. Vests. I'm going to wear a vest instead. Oh, dude, if they have a... Okay, wait. So if I can do a black vest, and if I can do a business shirt... You must be wearing a suitable jacket. No, if I can wear a suit vest. Wait, is that it? No, where's the one that I need to do the one underneath it? Where I can change the shirt color underneath it. How did I do that last time? Like, if I can wear that black vest and get a yellow undershirt, oh, buddy, that would be nice. Let's see, so I'm wearing the black vest. So I need to be wearing a jacket. So I need to be wearing a... Dude, I don't want to wear a suit jacket. Are you kidding me? Do they have a gold one? Maybe if they have a gold one, I will. Oh, no, wait, maybe if they have a black one, a black untucked one. Oh, dude, if those colors right there were yellow, oh, my God, that would look amazing. There we go. If they have this one, and then if I can do a vest, maybe? No? Why in the frick can I not change my vest? Suit vest. Oh, well, there we go. That's kind of working. But I don't have anything that's, uh... That's yellow, so that's depressing. Oh, God. What was the first one that I had? I think it was a shirt, right? Yeah, it was the mustard untucked. So we'll go back to the mustard untucked. Oh, well, that doesn't look that bad. That gives it the nice... That gives it the nice, uh... Things. Let's see. So we'll go with jeans. Can we get, like, black jeans or something? Like, super dark. There we go. Instead of slate, we'll go with black. And then our shoes, if we can find some shoes that are like that mustard color, that might not be that bad. Oh. That doesn't look that bad. You know what I'm saying? That doesn't look that bad at all. Helmets, masks, professional glasses, none of that, none of that, none of that, none of that. Can we give him a, can we give him a tie? No. Oh, dude, that'd be nice. A watch. Give him a yellow sports watch. That way, in case somebody does see it, they're like, hey. Wait, why did I freaking lose my everything else? You stupid loser. That one. Do I still have the watch on? I don't think I do. What the heck, man? Let's go in here with the shirts. See, that would look so nice if that was like a darker uh, thing. Okay, so we'll do mustard. Actually, that doesn't look that bad. So here we go. So now what we're going to do. Hey. Baller. <laughs> not going to lie. I do not regret buying all of those clothes now because I never would have known that. Oh, my God. That's amazing. All right. We're going to go all the way up here and we're going to change the color of ours in Torno. Why? Because this is actually going to... The card's actually going to look pretty sick with this color scheme. It's going to look really nice. Not even joking. You know, the things like coming through the back of my head. Gross. Matrix. Maybe. We can either do it with the Zentorno or we can do it with the Mustang because that Mustang has the thing. So anything basically with those secondary colors. This one's going to look really nice because it's going to have the, uh, it's going to have those highlights in the back and it's going to look really, really sick. That is, if we can find something that is that mustard yellow color. Hey, look, that's a nice Iron Man car. Nice. Nicely done. Who? I wonder who did that. They must have their head on straight. Get out of the way, stupid. Alright, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to go over here. Why is this guy just breaking middle in the middle of the road? I don't understand that why. But, we're going to hopefully try not to get murdered by this guy that is actually going to be right looking at us for the... Oh god, he's going over there. Don't kill me, brah. Don't do it, brah. Don't do it. Okay, so what I'm gonna do before I do anything is I'm gonna take a look see at what color I am. So I'm kind of—it's kind of like a red, uh, like a orange. 
There we go. There we go. So it's kind of like an orangish. That's him right there in the thing. Yeah. Okay. We're good. Don't kill me. Okay. We're good. He's hanging out right there. That's okay. You can hang out right there all you want. Oh, man. I didn't know if it was a black or a matte black that's in my face. Oh, no, wait, wait. I should be able to see it inside. Yeah. Perfect. All right. So let's go ahead and go with the little respray. Primary color. We're going to go with the classic. It kind of looks like it's, uh, kind of looks like it's matte, but I don't like the matte look on any of these. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to do, um, metallic. We're going to go all the way. Oh, I should have went the other way. Too late. Way past halfway. So if we can go here and we can go black. And then what we can do is if we can do pearlescent and we can make it like an orange. That would look nice. If we can do it like this color to where it looks black when you're looking at it one way. I don't know. Is that too much of an orange? I think that might be too much of an orange. So let's just keep it like that. Let's keep it as the black. Let's do secondary color. Let's do classic. Let's change it to that orange. Oh, there we go. There's orange. There's orange and sunset orange. It seems like it's kind of in between them. I kind of want to go with... I think I'm going to go with sunrise orange. I think that's... Dude, this is like a Halloween car. You know, I think that actually looks legit. I think that this is... I think we're done now. I think we're done. Let's go ahead and take a little look-see outside. Because I think that we just did it. Black and orange. Easy. Simple, easy peasy. Let's go ahead and stop like right here. Take a little look. See, what we, oh, see our, we need to have like an orange shirt. See, it's more like a yellowish. Because it's not, it's not a true orange. So. Let's go back in and let's see if we can make it like a yellowish. Excuse me. There we go. All right. So I don't know if they have that much of like a yellowish type thing. So let's do respray. Let's do secondary color. Classic. You know, what? I bet you ten dollars is just this orange. It's just going to be this orange. And then I think we're golden. And I think somebody else is coming in this thing, because I don't know why that thing was lifted up. Oh, God, there's a lot of people there. Holy shnikes, we're good. So if we can take a look-see at what this whole thing looks like. There we go. It's still kind of orangey. And now we're more yellowish than what it was. Oh yeah, that looks good. I mean, you're not. I don't think, if, as far as like for anything goes, you're not gonna get an exact color match. Yeah, that actually doesn't look that bad. That right there, my friends, you have just learned how to do a theme. At least the the red and black theme, or the orange and black theme. That actually looks really nice, and it will probably go on other cars. You can test it out. You can try to do it on your. Uh, you can try to do it on your other cars that have the secondary. I just like it because these slots right here look exactly like the mask. So, um, so yeah, that's pretty much about it. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Leave a comment down below on whatever you are thinking. Oh my god, you just ruined my car, you freaking loser. And he's trying to shoot me? Are you serious? No. Not even happening, bro. Alright guys, but as of right now, it looks like our time is up. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Leave a comment down below whatever you are thinking. And I will see you guys next time. Peace!